this is how to use the convert groups into link file here we have three models this is the original model which is the tower and the two behind is a group assembly of all these first building we have group it together so it's much easier to copy and group them to the to copy them into another location so did you know that in order to uh, lessen the files size once it is loaded in Revit we can actually use this group select this group and convert it into link so here we're going to select this group and here we need to select the link convert the selected group to a link file so let's select it here how do you want to convert the group replace with a new project file save group as a new project then remove the group instance and replace with a link to the project that already exists let's create a new so you have to save it as a new project let's go to the our folder so we don't have to and we have a reddit folder here so we have the same file except this is good save now it's converting the group objects or models and then converting it into a link file so once we completed the conversion we will have a look in the manage link properties or dialog box to see if the link has been inserted in our project uh, I'm trying to convert it into link because the file size, if I group the three buildings into one file, it will be uh, a huge file size for this project. So basically, when we have not first grouped it, so I need to check the file size again and then let you know how much it produces. some time convert it so now as you can see it's a loop file while this one is still a group file previously it's a group file this is considered link and this is our original object now let's go to our insert manage link and here we have the link as group. So we have successfully converted this group object and converted it into a link project file. Again let's select this one. Uh, let's go to the project file first and let's see how what is the file size. So we have some idea how big is the file it's about 59 or 60 MB so this is our project which we are working currently now 50, 60, 60 MB so let's convert this to me and see how much file size we will reduce just by doing that particular changes or conversion let's set it as group 2 the first one is group 1 again if we need to wait for it to convert it may take a while We are now at 68% processing. Eight. 
almost here 95 now it's completed it says ready now we have the model where we have converted the two groups into loops Let's wait for it to complete. Um, here you can see it's a loop, it's a loop, and then it's a loop model. So now let's save this. And let's check the manage link property in the insert. Manage link. We have group one and group two. Okay. Now let's go to the file and let's see how much file size it has reduced just by converting that particular groups into project. So now from 59, the original is 59 or 60, it has gone down to about 30 and so it's cut by half. So that is how to reduce the file size project file size by converting groups object into link object.